guys, welcome back to another episode of Daily Driven Exotics. My name is Damon, ripping apart Huracan Fryer. I'm getting really dramatic with this. We're in avant-garde, and this is Rap Legends car, and they're doing some crazy, crazy I can't tell you what all that is, but uh, I just made it really dramatic. Welcome to the vlog. Clean on the outside. Not so clean on the inside. And I just finished washing my hands. What do you guys think of this thing? I mean, for real, it's just, it's bonkers, this car. Look at this. You can really get in here. Look at all this stuff. So, I learned some stuff. Gas uh, door actuator. Uh, master ECU, slave ECUs on the other side, right? I'm learning. I'm learning some stuff. Um, yeah, that's gas. We got bags, right? This is the uh, the radiator for cooling the alternator I learned. I'm good, right? Yeah, you got it. You Tell got me it. I'm good. You're all good, man. Oh, by the way, Chris is here again from Supercar We're Suspects. And he was my boy who was holding the camera, doing the camera work. I don't trust anybody else with my camera except for Chris. So listen, this thing's on bags, right? And with this exposed rear quarter panel gone, check this out. You gonna hit it? The flex. That's so sick. It's so quiet. There's like, there's no three, two, one. I actually had that right on, right on time too. Okay, so much done to this Lambo, but so much more still to go. Why do you have your, why do you have your rear quarter panel off? Um, Come on, tell us. An accident happened. An you accident? Know, very unfortunate. You have accidents? Yeah. I never have accidents. So. Quarter panels off, no one's coming. That wasn't and funny. <laughs> <laughs> and then a new wrap's coming right after that. Right after we drop Alex's wrap, we're gonna drop our new wrap. Alex is getting a new wrap? Yeah, yeah. Behind you. I had no idea. Could see it. I had no idea. <laughs> oh, damn! We won't talk about that yet. So, new wrap, still got your wing on. So, we got new wheels coming and new wrap. Uh, my other pink wheels, I'm gonna sell. Shout out, uh, give us a shout out if you want to buy them. And then we got a new set of pink ones coming from Rotoform. Oh. Yeah. That's gonna look. Yeah. Nice. Uh, what else am I doing to the car? Uh, you gonna do anything to the power? I don't know. Still working that out. You know, might do some stuff with VF or whatever. Yep. Um, still trying to think on that. But for the most part, just trying to keep it simple and just have the look. You know? Oh, yeah, we're, yeah. we're trying to be the most outrageous looking Lambo right now. But it's a lot of competition. Challenge <laughs> accepted. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I should have just, you want most outrageous looking. I should have just left my wing on after I hit it. Yeah, that'd like, be crazy. Oh, eh. Yeah. You know? Nothing like driving down the road and just that really make you stand out. Yeah. You're like, nice Lambo, nice Lambo. <laughs> what the f Yeah, I'm thinking about riding with no quarter though. Looks oh, pretty cool. Oh, man. Can we do that together? Let me see. Let's, let's look right? at it. We got to keep the camera down so we don't... No spoiler alerts yeah, here with uh, what's going on behind us, so... Oh man, I think you could get away with driving it like this. I would take the front fenders off, everything off, and we should go do like a hot lap. Right. There's no clearance right here, but I'm touching. Ooh, it slams, it goes all the way to the frame. Oh yeah, it does. That is so close. And so, how does it ride? Straight up. It rides smooth. It rides smooth. It rides smooth, you know, I haven't took it on the track yet, but we'll but see. Compared to static. The same, Different. if not a little bit better. Like, honestly, you can't even tell. Oh. <coughs> what do you guys think? Should I join the, the bagged Lambo crew? Tell me, leave a comment. Do it, do it now. No, go ahead. No, take your time. We'll wait. It's all good, however long you need. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I just found this out. I've been staring at this car, and he's like, he never really just tells you everything. You know, you gotta kind of find out like 20 minutes into a conversation, but these guys put lights onto the Thai exhaust. How, you know what, I used to, five years ago, I'm gonna say this, five years ago, I used to lead this game. Now I feel left behind. These guys are doing shit that I've never seen anybody do. 
God damn! Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that shows off. Everything's so nice. I got out of my game. Can you believe that? What? How sick that looks, like lit up, the way they put the lights on the back of the exhaust. You haven't seen it? I have not seen it. Look! That's how we can drive around. Okay, that looks pretty sick. Right? Supercharged, so it's supercharged, right? Fully built, 1,450 wheel horsepower, and it's had over 1,600. Right, we're giving out rides and Jetta wagon, nice. Who wants a ride? That was the scariest experience of my life, right there. And he's shifting, right? So you're like, what the? Like a hundred. Who who's in the back? Oh, what'd you think? We've been in a lot of fast cars. What do you think? I, I can even, smell I don't it, bro. I don't want to talk about it. I think my pants are a little bit wet. 110 at the end of second gear. Yeah. 110. What do you? So you're doing 14 something to the wheel right now? <laughs> you know what you know what the best part is he's had this for like a couple of years now three years never crashed it how do you stock mustang owners feel we gotta do a redo oh, that man. last outro i just did with you uh i didn't turn my camera on oh. so hey you have one job i know keep that thing going. one job shout out to my boy mark from avant-garde here if you guys need anything hit these guys up i'm out of here we're going for sushi, sushi i just did this like huge outro but I didn't turn my camera on, so uh, we'll, we'll do one more round. This is the reality of the shit I gotta deal with every day. And I am in the VF Engineering C63S. This thing's amazing, by the way. Love this car. Shout out to VF, my boy Nick. He gave this to um, to Amir, because Amir's getting his G-Wagon tuned at VF. Nick was nice enough to give him his personal ride. I mean, that's the level of service, right? You hungry? Who's hungry? Save the hair. I'm so hungry. Hungry, 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 hungry. Look at this. Well, the cop pulls you over. That's the first thing he sees. Save the hair, boy. Yeah, that's your saying, isn't it? Yeah. I don't understand. Tell me the, the story behind Save okay, the Hair. I explained to Damon right now. I'll explain to you guys. First time I got pulled over, it was a bald cop. Second time, bald cop. Third time, the cop recognized me. He was just messing with me. He pulled me over, and I noticed he's bald. So at that point, I'm like, Yo, we're gonna start a GoFundMe for this guy's hair ointment, hashtag save the hair. And, and that's, how, that's how it all started. And now people are repping the decals on their car. That's crazy when I think about it. Yeah, Enya's What's his bald. name? The guy who pulled me over was Enya's bald too. Bald. They're all bald. I don't know what, what it is with like CH. Bald, it's mostly sheriffs too. They're all bald. I, yeah. I, I don't know. You know what? It is, hands down though, it's a stressful job. I think if I did it, I would lose my hair too, dude. Some of the stuff these guys gotta put up with, let's give let's give a little props to the cops who are the good cops. Yeah, no, seriously. Right? Straight we up. We have our cop friends. We have, we, we have a ton of cop friends. Yeah. Just, you know what? It's enough, it can come off really easy that we're just bashing cops. The ones that like straight up come up to me and give me like the no front ticket or no front plate ticket or like something that's legit, I'm like, Okay, I know that. I'll take the twenty-five dollar ticket. Even I can afford twenty-five even if it's bucks. Petty, like if they give me a ticket, I'll just take it. Like of whatever. course, they're just doing their jobs. But like, I get pulled over. I've had plenty of tickets. I've had speeding tickets. What do I do? Do you hear me bitching every time? No. Don't make me out to be the bad guy with police officers. I do appreciate you guys. You put up a lot of sh props to all the good men and women out there. We do appreciate you. Yo, this is what's up. We got dinner right here. What are we ordering? I'm not in the mood for this. Come on, you're ordering for the table, right? We should do that thing where we all we all order what we want, and at the end of the night, we all throw our credit card in, and we make the waitress pull one out, and that's who buys dinner. I'm down. We're sitting back there having the rest of our dinner, and these fools roll in with like the fog lights on. Oh my god, this thing's so bright, bro. He rolls up with the fog lights on. All you could see was the whole restaurant lit up. 
I turned around, dude. I thought the cops were here. I was like, they're coming for all of us. I'm used to the 4x4 feeling. So when I drive it, I'm used to it. I'm loving this car, bro. Dude, it's just a like. I love it. I need one. Me either, dude. Do you guys think DD should get one of these? Comment below. I think it's so sick. I'm tired. I'm tired after this, like, couple of weeks of just filming, 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 filming relentlessly. Woo! Filming, filming. Filming, filming, so filming, much. filming, 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 filming. <laughs> We are back. I dropped off the C63S for a couple of reasons. One, it's not my car. Two, apparently I can't drive with a Canadian license down here. I gotta get that cleared up. And three, I'm lazy as tonight. <laughs> I wanted to get driven around in this thing. And you were saying, I gotta try driving your car. You gotta drive it right now. All right, let's, let's do it. it, let's try it. So we're gonna take Chris's car. I really love these cars. I grew up with like all the JDM cars in my blood and I still love them. Fair warning. It's a stage three six puck clutch, extremely hard to get rolling. Extremely stiff and hard clutch. Like, huh. come, All come. Right. All right. So it catches right away? Catches all the way at the bottom. Oh, so so you gotta like, like Jesus feather yours. it. All right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at this, you guys. Damn, that luxurious key. I'm, I'm honored. <laughs> We're gonna get the lessons here. So it's reverse all the way to the oh, right, and down. right and down. So it's normal, it's normal. Yeah. And uh, see if I can reverse this without stalling you. Is that the, is that the trick? That's the goal right there. That's the goal Let's right see now. if we can do it. Everyone fails. Okay. There you go, he knows. Tap the gas. <laughs> Actually, it's not that bad. The lights are on, the lights are on. Are they? Yeah. They said they weren't. It's complicated. Like it so far oh i love it it's fun i mean the boost is cool yeah because you're kind of like get going and then all of a sudden it's like Neats. i just love all the sounds it's yeah. just so visceral we got the subi leading the pack okay chris old school handbrake thank you oh, yeah. chris of course mad props man thank you let me drive your baby this thing's a lot of fun I'm glad I get the shout out for being the first person who has not stalled his car with the stage three first clutch. First person, first person right here. Props to this guy over here. So you got some more stuff you're gonna do to this thing? The goal is 850 to the wheels. Right now it's maybe like three, 350 yeah, and it's already scaring me over here. I gotta drive it again then. Definitely, definitely. Okay. Pretty fun little road. Um, I mean, the road I've driven, but driving his car, I mean, I haven't driven anything like this in like ages. Yeah. So it just, it reminds me of when I had like my Integra. I had a Turbo Integra with 407 to the wheel, but we're talking like when I was 18. So 21 years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Love it. Chris. Dude, Chris, we, get, we need a zap trap here. Yeah, uh, my, my zip tire ripped 
stop on the way up here, so we got a little problem over here. So Andrew's boy is just showing up in an M5 that apparently shoots like the sickest flames. So here we go. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's nothing. Really? Bro, this long. Really? I can't wait. I gotta see this. Flamethrowers are the best. Holy! Wow! You're out? Yeah, I gotta okay, look brother. Okay. tomorrow. See ya. Bum, 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 bum. Yo, Andre. Yes, sir. Check this boy out, the supercar suspects. Pick up some merch, shopdd.com. Smash the subscribe button for our channel. Throw us a thumbs up. Check out my boy Amir on the car biz. I know I'm throwing a lot at you, but I'll put links in the description for everybody here. Peace.